Hey guys, uh, new version for Psyphaz. So I've been uh, rewriting it for just eight, like the others. So it's uh, much faster now uh, as it uses uh, GPU uh, and Direct 2D. So it's more technical uh, improvement, but uh, uh, it's much faster now. Uh, the performance uh, even on 4K screen. Uh, are uh, really boosted so it's cool and I have revamped a bit the UI like uh, like Psylab I, I think it's better to get more screen on top and the tools bar at bottom uh, so uh, on change yeah rebuilt with just 8 have uh, synchronized it's better synchronized with the screen previously it's not going technical but it was a timer uh, now it's fully the screen uh, frame uh, synchronized to screen frame rate. So this changed is previously we had a uh, we'll lower a bit. Previously we in setup we chose the um, the FPS. Now it's uh, Redux. That means at one it will be your maximum screen FPS. But if you have uh, like 120 FPS, it's maybe overkill. So if you choose two, it, it would make uh, half of the frame rate. So 60 FPS if you had. Uh, so you can't, if the best uh, frame rate will be at one, but if you have slow computer, or you, you notice that it makes other UI lag. Uh, I've got good GPU here, so it's okay, but. Uh, you can reduce uh, it in uh, setup, uh, graphics, FPS redux. So I've removed removed the OpenGL because uh, Direct 2D is automatic. Normally, if you have Windows 10 or uh, 11, and it would be uh, much more efficient. Uh, uh, what else? Uh, so yeah. Uh, I've changed something is we can directly on the curve selector previously we had to click on this to set the dry wet now we can directly also set on the main uh, main uh, button or we can use smooth wheel also and if we want to reset we have to right click on this one right click on this one shows the menu or you can click on uh, this for the menu and yeah it's for the on off of the effect uh, what else yeah, so I've, um, I've, uh, yeah, I've changed the bypass. A friend asked me if we press bypass, it keeps the latency. Uh, previously, completely bypassed the plugin, but the problem is we we had no more latency, and if if we want to compare with something, um, uh, some other thing, it uh, would be. Uh, shifted so now if we press bypass it's like if we uh, uh, go completely down uh, with the fader we can adjust the force of all the processor effects here and if we click to bypass it's like setting them all uh, down um, what else uh, yeah i've uh, reworked on the menu because if we had a 4k screen and the um, IDPI, uh, uh, not 100% uh, scale on Windows, uh, menu would be uh, would be too small, so this has been improved, and there could be a crash, I think, when we click it very fast on the menus, now it's been fixed, and uh, um, what, yeah, and I, I have, uh, added the cutoff, Ah, uh, you know we could uh, we'll bring back the sound. We could have uh, so if we enable the spectral engine, we could make uh, our custom curve and and control the cutoff here. Now I've exposed this, but this was not. Exp we could modulate it uh, from the plugin. Uh, like for example, I could assign a recorder to the cutoff, and here I could. Uh, record my automation but now it's also exposed to the door so if you uh, you have to refer to the door but if you press configure and move the um, 
the parameter here it's you see the parameter and you can uh, control it from the door and it will update the display and the other way around if you move it it will update uh, the, the display and you can have both you can have the modulation uh, let's say i record It's cumulative, so you can have uh, automation like ramp uh, going up and, uh, and stuff. For now, that's it, and uh, I'm uh, working on uh, next step. But uh, if you want to test, uh, because it's it looks uh, no big change, but it's uh, internally it's uh, completely a uh, lot of stuff are changed for the DX 2D. But you see, uh, uh, I think it's much faster. But I have to check everything is correct. So I hope you enjoy and bye.